knows all about you, but still loves you. Welcome to the Hour of Feeding on Jesus International. Today's reading Bible verse is taken from the second book of Samuel, chapter 9, verse 7. So David said to him, Do not fear, for I will surely show you kindness for Jonathan, your father's sake, and will restore to you all the land of Saul, your grandfather. And you shall eat bread at my table continually. Amen. Beloved, when the people of the palace heard that King Saul and his son Jonathan had died in battle, they panicked, fearful that David was coming to seize the throne and kill all the sons and grandsons of Saul. They ran for their lives. A nurse took Meshibosheth, Jonathan's son, and ran. But as she fled, the five-year-old boy fell and became lame in both feet. Reference Second Samuel chapter four, verse four. The poor boy would not have been crippled if they had known that David actually loved Jonathan and Saul. And would have looked after Jonathan's son because he had made a covenant with Jonathan. Reference First Samuel chapter 18 verse 3. In this story, King Saul represents the human race. He is like Adam who sinned against God and forfeited all that God gave to man. He had the position but not the power anymore because of sin. Jonathan, who came after Saul, represents Jesus, who came as a human. Jonathan was not like Saul. He was good, just as Jesus is not like Adam. Jesus is a perfect man. David represents God. So Jonathan's covenant with David speaks of Jesus' covenant with God. Meshibosheth represents believers today who are lame in some way sick depressed fearful poor and so on now Mephibosheth became lame because of bad news that was based on a lie many believers today are suffering needlessly because they believe the wrong things about God they think my sins has found me out God is coming after me. Well, I have good news for all my feeble chefs. David is not after you. David is not af after your life. When David looked at my feeble chef, it was to show him kindness, to take care of him and restore to him the land that had belonged to Saul, his grandfather. Likewise, God Beloved, likewise, God is not out to get you. He knows all about your sins and still loves you. That is why he sent Jesus as the payment for your sins. And because Jesus covenant with him, with God, he says to you, don't be afraid. I will surely show kindness. I will restore all to you and you shall always eat at my table. Amen. Beloved, share this video and bless the soul. Also, subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thank you. Amen. <music>